Hello everyone, welcome to No More Doubts. In this tutorial, we will see what is the LaTeX and how to program using LaTeX and what are the types of what are the parts of a LaTeX program and how it was different from a word processor. So, firstly, what is LaTeX? LaTeX is a document preparation system for high quality typesetting. It is most often used for medium to large technical or scientific documents, but it can be used for almost any form of publishing. LaTeX is not a word processor. Instead, LaTeX encourages others not to worry too much about appearance of their documents, but to concentrate on getting the right content. And in simple words, it is a simple typesetting program. Wait, wait. What is typesetting? Generally, to prepare a document using com computer, it involves four steps mainly. One, the text is entered into the computer, the input text is formatted into lines, paragraphs and pages and then output text is displayed on the computer screen and finally the final output is printed. In the word processor, all these operations are integrated into a single application package but whereas in a typesetting program like text is considered only with the second stage above which is the input text is formatting into lines, paragraphs and pages. So to typeset a document using latex we type the text of the document and necessary formatting commands into the text editor and then we compile it after that the document can be viewed using a previewer or printer using a printer driver we will see some of the latex softwares mic text text maker and many other latex softwares are available to install in the system uh, based on the os platform availability and overleaf and share LaTeX. These are the two mo mostly used cloud-based LaTeX softwares can easily access through internet. And next, why we need a LaTeX when we are having a word processor? The answer is it is to beauty. It can beautifully typeset technical do documents, especially those containing lot of mathematics. If you see some of the mathematical equations which are so complex cannot be easily written in word processors but whereas those can easily uh, can done in latex and we will see some examples now with latex and we will understand why latex is uh, needed when we are having a word processors let's see this example here this is an example typeset program um, the output of this is hello everyone welcome to course on latex but no more doubts here these are this document class 12 point article means this is the first command line in the program this 12 point says that the entire document the font size is 12 points and this says the type of the document is article this is the package we, inst uh, we included in the program ulm which is used to underline the text this command underline in the this used to underline the text in the flower braces using this command and begin document end document is the commands uh, the the entire program between these two commands will be compiled and the output will be printed here hello everyone is printed uh, two backslashes means is used to go for the next line and welcome to course on latex and again backslashes and by underlining no more doubts this is the output of the simple program and next we will see another example we can we easily understood this program right because it was in text but can you understand by seeing this because it was a program code this means the output of this uh, this program is this this is this uh, equation cannot be easily printed in word processors it was very tough to make this size of braces and the summation symbol and everything there but whereas with a single line of program we achieved this in latex that's the answer for the question why we need latex and next we will see the parts of the latex program latex program is mainly of two parts one is the preamble and the three document environment if we consider the first example we have seen in this part in this program the preamble is this which is document class which says uh, the type of the document and the packages we included and the second part is the document environment let's see more about the preamble the preamble includes defining the type of document you wish to create such as an article book report etc as well as 
to call to any packages you wish to use in addition to the default packages. For example, if you wish to write a journal article with 12 point uh, font size within Indian A5 paper, then use the pack and you also want to use the package graphics to include images, then the program is this. This 12 points means the size of uh, font is 12 points and we, A5 paper means the entire document is uh, printed into an A5 paper and the document is is A5 uh, sorry article and we, we will use the package graphics to include uh, images and next document class there are mainly some types some few types of document classes and we will see the usage of those this article is the most commonly used uh, type of document class this was used for short documents and journal articles whereas report is also one of the most commonly used for longer documents and dissertations and book is useful to write books thesis for by doctorates and letter for letters slides for slides rarely used and beamer is also type of slides which is used more when compared to slides based according to the future survival in uh, beamer and next document environment this is the second part of uh, a latex program this is the body of actual content of your document and include text tables figures images equations and anything else you wish to include in the actual document you may include header information such as title subtitle or the date and abstract in the document environment you may also format it to your liking through the use of chapters sections programs and appendices and if you see here this is the main environment begin document command and the end document command the entire program between these two commands is the main document environment and some environments can all can also be created between this in main environment like an environment for tables equations figures etc if you see here in between this uh, uh, main environment we also created a table environment we will see all these environments and how to create programs uh, and uh, re create report in all uh, and many other examples in the upcoming tutorials that's it for this tutorial thank you